This afternoon, the IAEA Board of Governors appointed me for another term as Director General. I am deeply honored by this consensus decision, which requires the approval of the General Conference. In the past six decades, the agency has made an enormous contribution to improving the health, prosperity, and security of the world. To lead the agency into its seventh decade is a huge privilege and a great responsibility. The agency's mandate, Atoms for Peace and Development, is extremely important for the lives of millions of ordinary people. We face challenges in all areas of our work, but I approach my next term in a very positive spirit. In the coming years, we'll work to maximize the contribution of nuclear science and technology to helping countries achieve the sustainable development goals. And we will complete the modernization of our nuclear applications laboratories. We will continue to carefully monitor and verify Iran's implementation of its nuclear-related commitments under the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action. We will remain our readiness to resume our verification work in North Korea once political developments make this possible. We will provide comprehensive assistance to countries which wish to introduce nuclear power or to expand existing programs. And we will assist countries in strengthening nuclear safety and security. Ladies and gentlemen, as Director General, I will continue to focus on delivering concrete results, responsiveness to member states' needs, and sound management. I am committed to improving the representation of women in the agency, especially at senior levels. We will implement a very broad mandate as a technical organization in a balanced and impartial manner in the interests of all member states. I thank you all for your work reporting on the IAEA and helping to get a message across to an international audience. I look forward to continuing to meet you regularly to keep informed about our activities. Thank you very much.